right, let's start it. Let's uh, let's not mess about. So, this is going to be the first, hopefully of many, power level chart discussions that I'm going to try and get people from the community to get involved in. Uh, I think these are like the two best players. Finrich doesn't speak English, so you know. Oh no, Fenrich. Fenrich's definitely the best player. <laughs> but he can't help us because we can't understand. So until I get a translator, we'll get the other two soul gods. Subatomic Saber. Uh, BD, BDG. Sorry, Subatomic Saber. Put some yeah, do on respect the sponsor's name. Yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry. That's my bad, my bad. I'll hold that. And uh, RMZ, before we get into the chart, important questions. We'll, we'll let... RMZ set pace. Let me go first. So there's three questions. I'm going to ask everyone who jumps on this. One is okay. your current team. The second question is your dream team. So if the game, everyone was broken, everyone was just as viable, uh, what would your team be? And the last question, the most important one, what your favorite fruit is? All right, this is easy. You want me to do this? Yeah, you go first. You go first. Uh, my current team is Sell the Goat. Uh, um... So Han, Team Gohan in his various form and Goku, the best Goku, second best Goku, sorry. Um base Goku. Uh my dream team is the team I actually play. Um with no exception. They're my three favorite characters in the series. Um, apart from him, obviously. There's my three favorite characters, so I took it them all. And my favorite fruit is the passion fruit. Damn, he already knew that. I was, I was hoping oh, you said fruit. Play. I thought you said I thought you said food. Oh, no, favorite fruit. Food, fruit? we could be okay. for a while. Kind of, kind of random, okay. okay. Super random. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, current team, Gotenks, Point, Cell Mid, Vegito Anchor. Uh, dream team uh, is my team, but I actually, I don't like Cell because of, cause of the series. I like him because of the game. He, like, the way he plays in this game is... It, it's better than uh, like the characters, the other characters, Vegito and Go, uh, Gotenks. I would probably play Gogeta, but yeah. Uh, so, so, so and sell, fruit... sell the function. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I respect that. <laughs> and uh, fruit is uh, probably mango. Mango. Okay, I'll, I'm going to compile a, a fruit a fruit list as well. And then hopefully it's gonna be an insight into the players. That's that's the goal. But the real goal is we're gonna start. So uh, I haven't shown uh, RMZ or sub the, the sheet. I'm yeah, I, I guess I don't need to. I just need to explain it. So what's gonna happen is I'm gonna ask your opinion on some subjects, basically or normal specials, supers, positioning on the team, assists and damage. Uh, I'm gonna ask you to mark it out of ten or five, depending on what the subject is. Then afterwards, I basically just add them all together, and that will be the power level. So, uh, this is where you've chosen for your follow. final resting so, place. So, let's start off with <laughs> some super, super basic stuff. We're gonna talk about normals. So, the first bit is about strings. Uh, to keep in mind, length of the strings and mixed potential. That's kind of what we're we're looking at. And I'm trying to get a mark out of ten for this one. Mm. <laughs> That's the I said, I, I, um, wow. Yeah, it's going to be kind of in-depth. Kind of in-depth. But uh, so You want to explain as well why we give the number. Sam, do you want to go first? Then? So, strings and mix-up potential? Yeah. Uh, well, Cell, as a character, I think he plays based off his normals, like, in terms of neutral. But, uh, strings, I think he's one of the best characters. It's It's... Him and a uh, adult Gohan, I feel, are like similar in a lot of ways, and how they wanna they wanna apply their 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 game plan or like win condition. It's just like turn turn blocks done from your buttons into mix-ups, and they do it easy, and they have like a lot of ways of doing it. So if if you're considering as the best to be ten, I would say maybe ten. <laughs> like what, what's ten to you, C4? I mean. 10 is perfection. It, it's his name. If you say 10, you can you can give a 10 and say there's no flaws in in that part, in that area. So if you so think... if, 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 if another character is better than him, okay, so he, maybe he might be like, 
Oh, wait, wait. I, I would, would say, say, I would say, don't think about other characters. Just him on his own. No, no, but we have to compare it to, like, if 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 someone else is the best, he can't be the best. <laughs> he could he be, can't be the best. He could be joint the best. Do Do you think there's any flaws in his strings and mix up potential? Uh, yes. Uh, in 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 this season right now, a lot of what he wants to mix you up with, mm -hmm. there are options, so you don't have to really deal with him. So it takes some conditioning, but uh, other than that, uh, he mixes you up like like the best characters in the game. Okay, I mean, well, to be fair, I'm just a moderator, so confer with RMZ. Let, you, you and RMZ <laughs> yes. were coming up with the numbers. I'm just I'm just <laughs> punching in the numbers. I'm yes. coming up. Oh. With, so yeah, you tell me if you want to base it on other characters, that's cool as well. Okay, so we're gonna pretty much you want us to rank these attributes of a character from like zero to ten. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, so what, what, what do you think after your pressure? Something after. Oh, not right after. So kind of OD Ramsey. <laughs> I mean, five L two L. Like the end of all his special. What I love is that every like if you if you want to look at just frame data, like he has all these options that are at, at, at like minus two, minus three. <laughs> Everything's yeah. like minus five. <laughs> a quick note. So with normals, there's the string part. The next part is uh, utility. So coverage and frame data. Oh, you, okay, okay. okay. Yeah. All right, so we're just, okay. just doing just strings. I, I, I'm in agreement um, with when some said um, even way back earlier that comparatively, I can't call him the best, but so strings are like, they're, 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 um, he has so many, too many lows. I'm, yeah. Exactly. Uh, you can't <laughs> trying to trying to trying to find opportunities to reflect against Cell is kind of hard because you always have to down back. Yes. So... Also, his block strings are very long, but I don't think that helps a lot in this season. But I think that helps too because it helps refresh your assists. Uh, so. Yeah. So I think yeah, uh, he's a healthy nine. Yeah, nine. he's he's on he's at least low nine, like yeah. at, at least ninety three or like nine point three. I mean, we I can we can add some decimals. I'm, I'm down for decimals. I, I could do a nine point three. I would take I would take ninety. Yeah, yeah. Right, let's, let's get I think that. what separates him from ten is just like if he chooses to stagger or try to take another turn, uh, it's it's more risky than some other characters. I agree. And, and 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 even going on from that, even if he hits you during the stagger, the execution of what he must do next um, carries a. There's a lot of um, uh, thought, uh, thought beforehand when you're doing strings. So when you actually land it, and the combo route you go after, yeah. Even though I know it, you have to think about it, a lot of our characters don't. <laughs> so you actually have to think about the next route you're gonna do. How to optimize it? Little tiny things. So, but, but that's something else entirely. Um, but yeah, I definitely agree with that. Well, I mean, what you're saying kind of goes into the next, the next section for normals. So we've done the first bit, 9.3. The next bit is utility. So frame data and coverage kind of falls in line with that, right? So again, it's another uh, mark out of 10. Uh, what do you think about Cell's utility of normals when it comes to like frame data and coverage? All right, so I went first on this one. I say nine immediately. Um, the priest would say nine straight away yeah. because he's minus two, minus three everywhere. No minus eight in sight. His worst is minus five, and his I would say special. But yeah, he he's minus two, and he beats reflect, and he has a built-in move, um, in five H, which beats reflect anyway. So you don't have to. You can just play if you just play around uh, options game and going around and you're doing strings with just playing with frame data. Cell can find out so many things from the opponent. You can find out if they're matching reflect. You can find out yeah. if they're holding up. Uh, you can find out if they're holding tag. Um, he's six M's after certain strings, we even plus. So yeah, yeah. he's nine for me. Um, what do you think? Uh, what else do you mean by utility, C4? Uh, like. So in my head with utilities, stuff like, uh, you know, I think everyone could do this to a degree. So like me, 6Ms after knockdown, uh, I was thinking cell 6M isn't the greatest for that just because of the range looks pretty, pretty short compared to other characters. Uh, yeah. Buttons, I, in my head, when I think of cell, I'm like, 
he can he's a very footsy sort of character like he can start a string from really far away and then he's instantly in your face like you don't have to worry about anything with him with him yeah uh so, um yeah that's my kind of idea but someone else might bring an idea to the table so yeah i mean a lot of a lot of corner setups i do is using his normals to the, like frame kill and then go for medis that cover all tech options uh he pretty much like 80 percent of his neutrals playing your normals playing outside your normal ranges moving around the screen i agree especially yeah he just easily covers techs as well and he's yeah and yeah. The air game too with his normals is, is it's like his safe that's his safe neutral he can contest in the air pretty safely with his his air normals. Yeah, his his jump light's been yeah terror to people from season, <laughs> from season one man yeah. I remember that like JM too like like I don't know if you guys remember Android sixteen hitting people with his with 16's yeah. JM it's almost like that too like you, you think it's not gonna hit but that kind of range you could potentially get hit by jm or id jm like trying to play footsies or in the ground game it's it's deceivingly large it's uh it's crazy i didn't think it was gonna start so strong but he, he is selling it like i, well, I don't know why yeah, but that, i mean i've been like we've been playing self like for a long time so that's that's like his core it's using his buttons so it's cool. yeah, if, if I had to, yeah, so if I had to strip so down to a button, it'd be like five then. But yes. yeah. So medium. so reason? Just mediums, mids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it would just be mediums, you know? Yeah. So for real. One thing that is like a bit different though is like usually in the close range your your go to is like mashing light. First cell, uh it's actually medium. Because yeah. five L is not that big of a close range button, but it has its uses, but main, mainly it's a media. And then you stack, because you hit them with 5M on um, C4, you got 5M, oh, I hit them. Oh, that's... <laughs> 4M, oh, it's still hitting. I like M, way, <laughs> oh, we hit. I like the way Rams is telling me like I've not been hit by his cell doing that. <laughs> I know we it's a first hand experience. Stop. <laughs> And then he just finishes off the combo. It's just amazing, amazing time. Oh, that's a new realization, right? So that I think that's a realization. <laughs> like yeah. um, the oh. fact you can confirm the five M a million years away. It's gross. Five M, yeah, it's good. It's good in like the scenarios too. Like so let's say the opponent tries to end in minus five and they try to backdash. Like yeah. if you if you fuck up your backdash or miss time and you get hit by that five M, like and. I don't know, that cell just confirms into medium perfect attack in the corner. Oh dead my character. Gosh. And the block stun on that. <laughs> the, yeah, the hit stun, sorry. The, the, the hit stun, the, when he does 5M, he has so much time to yeah. do anything. It's crazy. Cool. Uh, we'll move into the next part. And hearing what you sort of saying, I think he's going to score pretty high on this as well. Uh, <laughs> so the next bit is specials. So it is the split into two parts again. Uh, specials in terms of space control. Uh, how his specials cover the screen, uh, where he can sort of apply them. So uh, an example is he's got a jump beam. So he can apply pressure from full screen if he's got bar sort of thing. Uh, the other half is going to be properties of the special attacks. So special mm -hmm. attacks, like perfect attack, stuff like that. Uh, so mm -hmm. we'll start with uh, space control. What would you give him out of 10 on space control? Hmm... Because so you got to run around a little <laughs> you yeah. he, he used to be a conductor. Now he's he can see him run, you know? Yeah. So this one's hard him. too because uh like I just like knowing when something's like significant, like like winning that match, it's kinda hard mm -hmm. to base it. Maybe uh what's a good example of like top tier special? I'd say maybe like the like GT or Kid Boo. Cause I don't think cell specials aren't that good, but it's in terms it gets of the job control. So I'm, I'm, like in my head, I think of stuff like rolling crush. So when you're in that like uncanny valley of being above someone and you do heavy rolling crush, it's, it's not as strong. obnoxious. Oh uh, so so uh, we might have to like separate like neutral in terms of pressure. I think perfect attack is really good for pressure because like it's it's so it's so brain dead to just 
confirm a situation, it's a perfect attack assist. Mm. But uh, like a neutral, like perfect attack, trying to trying to guarantee an approach with perfect attack is so much of a risk. But you 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 do cover like the like pretty much like half the screen, half the ground, cut a bit of the air. Mm. But you have to cover with assist to be safe. Yeah. So and, and um, even adding on to that, I, I um, Cell doesn't yeah he doesn't really force the issue. You in that situation, if you're talking just purely specials, you yeah you're not doing perfect attack to to approach or attack someone unless you have obviously point five yeah. bar. You do whatever you want, right? But you're not yeah dealing... he's not relying. On, yeah yeah the opponent relying. the opponent's not too worried about dealing with Cell's special moves in neutral. Yeah, it, it, you you really yeah you saw them use it. You're not just gonna throw out H rolling props on the ground because of reasons, you know. Um, uh, and from full screen, yeah, his comment, yeah, this I feel like it's just more. It's like a commando character, right? It's like you you know he has a, 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 um, a beam, so you're aware of the beam. Even his job S, it's a really, yeah. really really slow thing that people yeah. know he has. So they were aware of it, which you never use. Yeah, but, and it's really hard to like not whiff. If you're gonna do it, you can't whiff it. You gotta, you you gotta be it. able to hit it. It's really hard. Yeah, it's weird. I would tell them that. Yeah, it's such a bad. They buffed it as well, but um, yeah, it's a weird one. I, and I, I feel like they're too situational. Even rolling crush, people are like, oh, he's above you. It's not season one where you do L rolling crush. And yeah. drunk, you know? well, that was that was that was that was Mr. Perfect. That was John <laughs> Lane. <laughs> that, yeah. was, that was that Mr. was Mr. No Fly Zone. Zone. Yeah. So I don't know. I don't think his his, his specials um, in if you're trying to control space and and do stuff like that. I don't think they're they're not, they're not really that good because Cell's movement and normals do that for him. Right. His, the threat of perfect attack and his normals do that. And you thinking this is is. So it's big brain. He's you thinking of the special. Oh, he's above me. He could rolling crush. Right. So I'm not going for two H. So, you know, yeah. like, the, the grappler fear, right? Where everyone has to play it, different around cell, not because he can, uh, not because he has that tool, just because he can do that tool. Yeah, it, it's it's an option, but it's just it's it's more risky and it, it, it's too committal. So, yeah, yeah, that's the one, that's the one I'm looking for. If you wanna, yeah, if you wanna ever go for it, it has to be guaranteed. Yeah, so I don't, just because of that, he wouldn't. He's not in the eight or nine for me. Just or, or even seven for me. He'll, he'll be like in the low six, just because of that. But perfect attack. Just on on if we're doing for like zoning. Yeah. Right. So the two really categories. Annoying. What was the other category? The one was, was coverage, that? right? Yeah. The, the first one we're talking about now is uh, space control. Uh, the space next control. one's going to be properties. Okay. So space control. What are you thinking? Dude? I mean, he covers. He covers the space. The special move covers. If we're talking about perfect attack covering space, yeah. Uh, then yeah. <laughs> Man, that cover top of the screen, bro. What other assist cover space like, like <laughs> PX perfect attack? <laughs> but is yeah. Okay, you know, you know we were, we were explaining how it's faulty because it's a, it's it's so it's so committal. But, but this is the thing. This is why I wanted you guys to tell me about it because I would see perfectly get a perfect attack and go. That's a half screen DP that he can make safe and get a mix if he does uh, the H version. But you guys can break down why it's not that good and why you can't just do it. So yeah, like definitely tell me like why you think it's not as good as most people would think. Right. So no, it's it, no, it's definitely good. Um, it, it's 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 definitely a, a great move. But what you have to consider is if you're just throwing it out. Um, and you have, you, first you have to have resources. So if you're just hitting them with perfect attack, you're only going to do a few thousand of damage. And if you have no assist with it, then it's pointless. It's, it's literally pointless. I mean, and, and, it, and if you're on the spot, um, and you're not, and you, you know the route whatever, yeah, you can do probably five or six K or seven K damage. Um, if you do the correct spark route, and if you have an assist to finish off, or if you do it self solo, you can build about three, four bars by himself. Yeah. So, so that it's great, but. That that's in conjunction with something else. Right. If we're just really talking of of the move and just throwing it out, yeah, it's great. But he has he has he has that move for controlling that space. But that's one move out of all of his special. Yeah. If we're just saying, he's perfect attack. Of course, you know? yeah. his up beam's pretty 
awkward like the angles too up if you ask me it's not like a it's not a very it's not a gt goku angle then yeah, it'll be but yeah, sick. no one ever does up beam i don't know about david <laughs> i'm not sure i'm not sure about, about the no, I don't. no one ever my shoots brain is too small for up beam <laughs> yeah up beam, up beam is up beam is mad that is um, the netflix strats that is a mad yeah. angle. That up beam is, it might as well be jam session. <laughs> that up beam might as well be jam session. It's, it's a crazy angle. I, I can't think of any use for it. Maybe there is. Maybe I'll. Uh, up beam go up beam goes into the wind. Up beam goes uh, I think a good way to rank this is if the special requires an assist to be able to, to be safe. Mm. And uh, what else? I guess that's just it. If it requires an assist, because I'm thinking of top tier like special moves and like when GT Goku throws out EX Dragon Fist and he whiffs, like I'm scared yeah. that GT Goku might come out on top of this. Yeah. Or if Kid Buu throws out EX Mystic Ball, like without an assist, you know, mm. they're they're not too worried. Or maybe maybe Yamcha with EX Wolf Fang Fist. So when when Cell throws throws out EX Perfect Attack. On block, you are kind of safe because you you are airborne and you're like minus one. But when you whiff, that's a problem. With yeah. with Kid Buu and GT whiffing, like uh, okay, if we're, if we're right. comparing it like that, yeah. Then 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 it's not the same as those. Those would be like the best, right? Okay, so those are the best. Then you have base Vegeta and all of those, and we're going a bit lower, right? Yeah, um, I would, I would say probably seven like space coverage probably seven he does he does what the best do it's just uh on whiff he is he is pretty much going to have to hold mix or die and uh you have to call an assist if you want to take advantage okay and just to let you know c4 that all of that is just based on ex perfect attack that's not even all the other things. <laughs> yeah so I mean, EX perfect attack yeah holds but the thing is it still doesn't he doesn't yeah he doesn't he doesn't play neutral and you know spacing with with specials like he's, he's playing in inside and out with his buttons and mm -hmm. and and kind of his specials oh yeah and 2s does 2s count as a special or or, 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 uh, or, yeah. or, 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 or i uh, yeah if it does it definitely fits into seven category all right okay so 2s and h perfect attack have yeah. lifted cell to seven <laughs> if all perfect attack didn't exist Cell would be like some short, the the, the tallest short limbed character I've ever seen. Exactly. Like he's he's doing top tier stuff. It's just he's so tall. <laughs> yeah, he's just tall, man. I was he's like, it's fault in season two. Like you didn't even get a chance to play Cell because he had to hold Mix because he's so tall. Yeah. Cool. Right. We we've got seven in there. Uh, I'm gonna add uh, some information. Like I think we should probably count command normals as specials. I might do that for the future because like you said uh his 2s and stuff like that i might have to add that like niche bit in there uh but next stay on the topic of specials uh out of 10 unique properties uh so i guess that's uh that would count the, the, the mozart i guess that would come under the specials then if i've just put the uh oh uh, yeah yeah, yeah so, the conductor, the condu conductor. yes the conductor the conductor uh Obviously, perfect tap being invinci having invincibility. I'm not sure if he's got any more unique properties. I, I guess Rolling Crush now has a weird hey, 50 50 option to it. Uh, but yeah, out of ten, what would you uh, what would you give selling this? If the best specials are, as David said, the the um, uh, if we to go in on the GTS. And the kid boos, yeah, sure. and the yamchas. If we're going by that, and then I go to sell, it's it's night and day. But when I compare sell to the rest of the cast, I'm thinking I'm just thinking purely limit break situation. And I see sell with all the bar. Really, I'm not really too afraid until I'm mid until I'm in the middle of the screen and I'm jumping. But <laughs> then I'm scared for my life. Um, but yeah, just out of that basis alone, I. I I don't know if he could be a nine or an eight just because of that. But uniqueness, hate perfect attack is just ridiculous. So it actually, can't be a nine because obviously GT and those would be a nine. But hate perfect attack alone is just too much. It's just ridiculous. It's, really it's so mental. It's mental. Yeah. Um... What are you thinking about? Are you thinking about Rolling Crush? 
No, like unique properties in in what way? That's what, what do you mean uh, by so in my head, I was thinking of stuff like invincibility. Uh, I guess we could add plus frames in there, uh, uh full screen command grab. They're, they're kind of like properties of moves that I'm thinking of. Oh, okay. So, so, so David, you mean, imagine like Bluku, who's got like all the hate moves in the world that do like a million different things, and we just have perfect attack. Or like, uh, what's it? Is it jump? Yeah, so jump definitely, to him? like, if you were to rank, like, Cell's like one of the characters with, who has one of the most special moves. Yeah, so I forgot about it. jump. Is it jump to M? The, the cross up? Cross up chop? Yeah. 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 That's to me. That's like a unique. Uh, so property. just the number of the number of options is what yeah. you mean. Yeah. Yeah. So he uses them for public. Yeah, he'd, yeah, he'd be high then because he has like he's one of the characters who you don't even it could work if you don't have true mix. If it's not like same frame mix ups, you could kind of just rotate between his his just the amount of like options he has with like the cross of JM, the command grab. Uh, in season three now he has left right with ex rolling crush uh he did have same side uh air rolling crush ex rolling crush or cross up ex rolling crush uh air beam similar to ssj goku so he yeah. could definitely get the hit um trying to trying to rotate all those rather than going for like a same frame or like you know dragon rush yeah. And even um, but, and even um, perfect, you know, perfect attack. If like even in the combo situations, Cell's one of the few characters that can actually decide what side you're gonna go on. He'd be like, "Oh, perfect attack, vanish." I think I want to put you to the corner now. I like you mid screen. Oh uh, yeah, that's a good point. That sh that should have went for. Yeah, that, that makes that makes that makes him pretty unique with special moves, yeah, having to um, side switch during pressure. Or during combos, it's but that, that's the significance—that's the thing—is it's yeah. like, like one special move alone, or like one thing about a special move alone, can be so strong that, like, like GT Goku with EX Dragon Fist, it's like that special move alone has just dominated season two, yeah. and. I don't know if that's necessary. I don't know if Cell is necessarily like having all that uniqueness makes it better, but I would probably say like eight. But it's unique. That's the thing. Like if if you want to say how unique he is with special moves, that's a ten. But the significance of it, probably eight. I agree. Seven, that's eight. Definitely not nine because nine. Like if I look at Blue King and I see Ex Shoulder, Ex Dive, Ex Grab. Um, freaking tele instant trans transmission, same side, this transmission behind you, two H is transmission side switch. All the stuff that Cell was doing, <laughs> all the beautiful stuff Cell was doing, he, he's kind of got built. And if, if I'm going to have that and GT and, uh, at the top of the pendulum, I don't think Cell's there, but he's better than me. Yeah, and they're not at the top because it's like they're unique. It's just. They're super good. It's. Yeah, yeah. So you, you don't so need fast, anything other. So little yeah. recovery. Yeah, it gets the job done. I like, think trying to—it's not as situational. That's the thing too. It's—it's it's so consistent. It happens so much in a match. Mm -hmm. And then trying mm -hmm. to go for something very situational, like in Cell's case or like Blue Goku's case, it's hard to have those like and be able to do it. So. Yeah, I hear what you're saying. It's kind of like yeah, he's got a million options, but only like five of them might be good like in any given situation sort of thing. Whereas you've got people like uh, Yamcha with Gale, which is always good to do that because <laughs> it's so yeah. hard to punish, right? So yeah. should we say like a seven and a half, 7.5? Yeah. Or did you, want to, yeah. did you want to go for a solid eight? Ooh. Eight's perfect, like it's really good. 7.5, 7.5. <laughs> <laughs> Right. <clears throat> Seven point five. Right, that's specials over and done with. Okay. It should get a little bit easier from now on. Uh now we're talking about special uh sorry, supers. We've done specials. We're talking about supers. Uh again, two two points to supers, both marking out of ten. The first part is DHC scaling and flexibility. So, D -D -D -D. scaling and flexibility. 
Uh, so follow up extensions. Uh, can you make certain supers that don't have a slider knockdown have a slider knockdown? That sort of stuff. Uh, um, is, does that make sense? Okay. Oh, actually, no. Yeah. You know what makes sense if I say the other part? So the other part of this would be setups and uh, just raw damage. Okay, so the first one is DHC then? Yeah, DHC scaling and the flexibility. So, you know, if you... That, is that all together? Is that all together? Yeah, that's all together. Oh, shit. <laughs> what was the first one? Uh, DHC scaling okay. and flexibility. Uh, when I think of flexibility, I'm like, okay, so if I do a 2H, can I DHC into uh, level 1 into cell? Or can I do cell level one into something, for an example? Okay, I'm doing knee jerk. Um, thing on this one. I'm I'm doing a quick knee jerk six, hundred percent six. That's my knee jerk reaction. Okay, I don't know. When it comes to just raw damage, I'm sure the the tech lords have the numbers, but uh, it's it's average. I feel it's not like it's anything special. And um, having like double super or snap after super uh isn't that isn't as consistent as it was before so so they said again dhc uh dhc scaling and flexibility that's that's the first one okay so so dhc for me when i'm D, when i'm doing so dhc to someone else it's good that it's great in that situation because he can dhc and it can take as long as you want and to me in tournament that means a lot to be able to, to to do a super and DHC into cell, it like that breathing time that you allow, and also <laughs> on that, that it, you, I, and you're laughing because you, you know <laughs> when you do that super, you get to think about yeah. who's my next character. That is so like it's it's like a half a second longer of like doing the maths. Yeah, you get to do the maths, and and for, for me, my team, I I get to actually pick. So that to me, that's huge. And also with cell, if I've lost my styling knockdown on my team, I can always go into cells level one or level three, and I know in my heart this is gonna hit. Like if I've lost my sliding knockdown, I do L L L in the air, and I switch out to cell. Cell is going to hit you. It might be a dodgy hit with level one, and I'll, I'll lose like I'll only do hundred and ten damage. Yeah. yeah. So. Do you agree? Uh... Yeah, actually, yeah. I was because I was thinking because you know mid screen. Like, let's say Cell does a B and B mid screen, and he does J H knockdown, J H sliding knockdown instead of medium rolling crush sliding knockdown or light rolling crush sliding knockdown. I don't think he could level one super. That's why a lot of his routes is having to him do the J S into J two M vanish. But yeah. you, you're usually doing rolling crush sliding knockdown. So I guess yeah, in that so sense, that's not that's not that's what makes it not good. But DHC wise, he always tracks to the opponent when your DHC mm -hmm. uh, does the damage. It's like he, he's not the best, but he does, yeah, he does the damage. But flexibility, uh, yeah, like um, so I was saying, I don't, I, I don't like his flexibility for for his super mid screen just because of the fact that yeah, if you somehow do a dodgy route, you have to do um, either spend the bar now, 0.5 bar, or you have to do. Um, if you just do L L L and you try to dash or you do vanish like trunks, you got to either spend one bar to to spend the bar, um, yeah. or you have to do a specific combo that you sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Sometimes I'll just go straight into super like after doing the air to air, the air combo, oh, <laughs> just straight into energy field. No, just super wise, not DHC, but yeah. You see, you see, you see. So like, yeah. for that. Flexibility, I, I don't like it. And he said scaling, scaling cells is good. He's like, he's in the, he's not the upper quartile, but he's good. Like him, Bardock, and they, they're in that, that region where oh, cell killed. <laughs> okay. okay. Oh, yeah. But it's not nothing amazing. So yeah, that's it for me. DHC is not great, but the other two are. Um, yeah. He's not that great uh, in super, in my opinion. Yeah. What's a what's a top? What's a ten DHC? Bardock. Sarda? Wow, he said that with venom in his voice. Even. I, I know it. I just noticed it. Yeah, Bardock's Bardock's ball is like ridiculous. Bardock's ball. Let me go. Let me go through the head. So, would um, ten be like DHCs that knock them down? DHCs uh, that knock down the time. Ten's one keeps you from the air. Bardock's one just blaps them. 
<laughs> it's a big fat wall. Tien would Tien probably be like up there too, right? Because he could do level yeah, two. Yeah, I think Tien's definitely number. I think Tien has the best. It tracks anywhere. You can do you can do your first level one anywhere on screen. Go into Tien, get a knockdown, and do mad damage. I think Tien is like unquestionably a ten. And you can okay. spend another bar on it if you really wanted to. Okay. Yeah, I'm looking at the, the characters. Yeah. If I can it, 21's even good. Even though I don't yeah, like Kid Boo, like it knocks him down. You get advantage after. You could outplay yeah. them off a of DHC. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. So if I'm comparing them, even base Vegeta is now, man. Yeah, minor, base, yeah. It's minor. Yeah, yeah but, base Vegeta yeah. tracks. Yeah, that, yeah. Yeah, cells yeah. are so straightforward. Nothing special. It's just yeah, like nothing it's average. Yeah. It's funny, it's actually. Epic to be like slightly average. below average. I think average is probably like all the same supers, like beams and mm -hmm. Big Bang Attack. So. Yes. I think Big, uh, Big Bang Attack is the. I think that is the. I think that's one of the most perfect. I think to me, that's what cells should have been. Uh, quick, just an attack. Like a quick attack. Oh, yeah. Bang yeah, damage. The fact I mean, that it multi hits too doesn't make yeah. it. Yeah, and because those is multi hits, and, and for for certain TODs, and I know you know this, so for certain TODs with some characters, you gotta like wait out a specific amount of time of when the orb starts opening his chest. Mm. You know, so um, for me, if I'm just adding all that stuff together, Cell is just below average. On um, he's like with 116, and with other characters. Yeah, so we, what is that? Uh, 4.5? Yeah. Yeah, if we do, that's, that's DHC scaling and flexibility. flexibility. Yeah, and flexibility. Or below average is what, like 5.5, 5, right? If you're I... if you're below 5, you're like... Yeah, but he's not below 5. He's not that bad. He's not that bad. He's not that bad. Do you want to go with 5 then? 5.5. 5. Yeah, 5.5. Okay. 5. 5. He definitely four point five is like your la it's a fault to even go for the DHC. Five point five is yeah. it does what it does, it's just nothing special. Yeah. Four point five is Fidel mate. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Four point five is like like Teen Gohan or something, like you can't even super mid screen. Old, old Teen Gohan. I would say yeah, that would have been a four point five in my head. Old Tohan when he's uh his up beam didn't drag you down. <laughs> Yeah, that's true. Because even even um Blue Vegeta's Gallic Gun, at least he can run forward. You know, he can do LOL and like run forward. So yeah. <laughs> I don't have that luxury. So I was like, ah, <laughs> let me just whiff this and not and do it in the air. But yeah. Um, so what's the next one after this? The next one is uh sticking with supers. This one is setup and damage. So setup is like getting a DR afterwards or having so much advantage you get like a meaty. Uh, and obviously damage is damage uh like sub said i'm sure there's some uh there's some lab rats in the uh in the chat i've got your damage here yeah this one can you can objectify that rank like if someone actually like <laughs> just ratioed all the damage numbers into rank like they'll be able to figure it out i'll put it here it should be here somewhere i guess we can we can talk about setups because i i don't know if energy fields that good like i've always seen people dhc out of energy field i've never seen someone go i'm going to do energy field and then do something with so afterwards it seems to be like sort of like how when out of gohan's level up at least they kind of they can sort of chase your tech i've never seen anyone try to chase a tech after energy field i know energy field energy field has very pretty fast startup but uh i i don't see a lot of there's not a lot of cell players that's a thing too but uh, yeah. I don't see I don't see people save DHC with it like with how people do with Yamcha or Adult Gohan. Yeah, it's he can't he actually unless you do a specific DHC with a specific character before <laughs> he can't create like a scenario like Adult Gohan where he he uses the fact that he recovers fast but his special still going and does some really jammy thing. So set up it's really not that good. It's great for characters if he has like um, a base Goku on his team or, or other characters where he allows other characters to do stuff, but that's not him. That's just... And uh, damage-wise, he's around like the 8, 10 mark, so he's up there. So he's up there with the, the hard hitters. Like, like, there's only like... 
Yeah, he's in he's in that league of, of the the the, the eight hundred. So he, he he's good. So he, he's up there with the Nappers, um, Kid Boos, um, Hit Vegeta. All of them. They're, they're all in like the same bracket. Obviously, Team Gohan and TN are, are and obviously seven um, seventeen are just gods. But <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I wouldn't. Uh, I, I don't think he's for setups. He's pretty bad like doesn't do anything except for one character in the whole game now was that spirit like, bomb yeah except for spirit bomb which is which, which to me is worth it but i don't feel like he, his setups post level one are really good and what was that one set up and uh set up and damage uh i mean i guess set up damage the whole there. without the dr thing with like you know with snaps not dead but for the most part most characters aren't really going for snaps anymore I know before you used to be able to get a DR after energy field if you had something quick like Big Bang. Uh, I guess. I guess would, that, would that be a category? Like, does the super set up into Spirit Bomb? <laughs> yeah, and then be one. That, uh, there should be a, a category just for that, to be fair. I might, I might work on that. Yeah, there's it's... Gallic Gun, there's, there's Super Saiyan Blues, uh, Gallic Gun, and um, 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 there's, like, there's so many characters who are really good, but Cells one's just complete. Keep it in the air, all sorts. But um, going back to damage. Like, you have to, except for Tingo, Huntian, and all the other high damaging characters, mm -hmm. sells like top five most damaging level ones in the game. Like, scaling, mm -hmm. you know? So, I didn't know that. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, because you always like, go into Spirit Bomb afterwards, so I never see the energy field damage. It's just because it's, it's just the big ball. But <laughs> I say top five, just everyone else is crap, and there's a lot of people who are the same as him. So there's Cell, yeah. there's Super Saiyan Goku, there's like, it's, there's all these characters that just I think do that. I was, I'm looking at the cast. I think a ten, a ten for this attribute would probably be like Super Broly, because he yes. he almost gives everyone what slightly knockdown after his super. Yeah. So that's okay. that's like the most significant. Mm -hmm. And I don't think so about that. Yeah, Cell is like situational, like with Spirit Bomb or other characters. Yeah, he's so like just does the damage. And like I feel like they just simplify. Like after season one, with all the double supers, like now you just meter dump level three knockdown. Or you just spend the damage level one knockdown or level one super. <laughs> That's how it seems. That's how it seems that most people are like deciding to spend their bar now. Just kind of like yeah. the beginning of the game where everyone's going, okay, spend all the resources to kill. Now we're kind of more finessed. We can go, okay, let's try and kill without using spark. So meter dumping is even more important. So. Yeah, because back in season one, like Super Saiyan Goku, like with his up beam into oh, nice. being able to double super after his up beam, and the yeah. fact that he could solo double super, like yeah, that that was this is like a, a great category for if the game was still season one with double supers. Yeah, but yeah, spending DH saying now is like straightforward. Yeah, so i um, just because of that, mm -hmm. uh, I don't think yeah, cells not um when you if you're doing level one with cell, you're you've been you're losing to me, you've been losing. If you if you have to do level one with Cell and it's not a level three into yeah. a slight knockdown into a knockdown hard knockdown sorry into mm -hmm. make them get a game you're doing that level one and they're not dying is because your first character got destroyed or something yeah. something, something happened something happened but you had to bring Cell in and you level one because you're not getting anything after it like they're so high up they, there's nothing you can't touch them perfect attack doesn't reach. Coming with hard doesn't reach. Mm -hmm. Jump to him doesn't reach. And you can't touch them. So I I might um, in the future change this to something like uh, what do you get after the super? Just because of what like what sub said in in season two these would be good questions. Now kind of everyone does the same thing. But if we think about yeah. okay so base coup when he does his level one he can take you to a corner like he can pick what corner he puts you. Yeah. In. Super Broly literally has Oki okay after supers. <laughs> Yeah, super, super body and base base is plus fourteen after one yeah. after one thing minus plus four yeah. after the other. Like base is just the epitome of guess for game. Like you have to guess for the game, and he reacts to the option. Super body is just an overbearing force that's in front of you that can kill you at any moment. And we, and we, yeah. we can play cell to the nature. No way, no, no way. Are we? Damn, are we going sort of like the five, six region again? <laughs> I think it's terrible, man, but his damage is amazing. <laughs> yeah, yeah that's, damage. The, the damage kind that of up. saves him slightly, right? Hmm. 
even then, like, see exactly what <laughs> what Sam just did there. That's what I say. I'm like, yeah, so what if he does damage? Yeah. It's not his like, role. Like, obviously, supports would shine in this 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 category. So I'll just mix. Put you in jail. Yeah, Sam's not made to be on the bench. He just he's yeah. just. He's supposed to be at the front. Not that support know. value guy. He's not TN. He's out here doing his thing. Mm-hmm. Agreed. So we'll go um, with number wise. Boy, he's he's pretty bad, man. For damage setup, well, he had good damage, but the setup is nothing crazy. Maybe it's seven. Seven. Six seven. Because <laughs> the damage. You said he's upper quartile of damage. Yeah, yeah. He's upper. He's like yeah. He's upper. Yeah. Quartile. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but his super has like it's not like you're using it for setting up stuff. No, so so okay, okay, let's, let's, okay, so if in F ninety fifth on um um upper quarter in one and then he's like All right, so right. six. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, 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 that was getting See, that just saying, he's, he's trying to get the mean, the average, the range, all of the all of the stats. <laughs> Right, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll give because I had I had this talk to myself all the time about so super. It's so bad sometimes <laughs> the damage. I'm like, oh, get the answer. Right, <laughs> yeah. the 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 points are slowly getting normalized. From, from starting from like nines, we're slowly going down. But uh, we've got a couple more. Uh, next, this should be pretty. Sh mm, I always said it was gonna be straightforward. This is probably not gonna be straightforward. So the next part is positioning. So on a oh. team, we're gonna give Ooh. five points. Four point, five points for mid, five points for anchor. Any reasoning you want to give? Totally. Five? five. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'll, let, I'll, let, I'll let some of her. For point, I would say four, mid, mid four, anchor three. Four, four, three. Four, four, three. All right. Yeah. Rams. You, uh... I do not argue with any of them. <laughs> I am in one hundred percent agreement. All right, all right. Tell you what, give me your numbers, <laughs> and then we can talk about it. So I can write it down. So four, four, three for right. sub. What, what are you say? And mine are four in uh, four, four in point. Uh, we'll explain after. Four, four, uh, four in point. Yep. If, if he's the first character, if he's second, actually, if he's second this season, um. Nah, he's, yeah, he's still, he's still over. Yeah, if, if he's second in this season, I think 3.5 or 4. If he's second in this season, just because in this season, I, I spent after. And last position, he's a 3. I mean, yeah. you, you're basically the same then. Basically the same. Yeah. The, the only separation I have um, with David in this one is the only reason I won't put him in 3. Three point. I was thinking of three point five. I just had a thought of, about it. Is just because, um, in this game we now have an anchor, an actual anchor position, right? So yeah. we we have the before we never had this. Now we actually have limit break and and all these things. So when when Cell is is thrown into this position, I, how I feel Dragon Ball Z should be playing now is you should if. There could be any event that happens that you lose a character and so end up last, right? And I only put you in 3.5 because he, his, other, his teammate might die and so last. That's the only reason I put in 3.5 because I don't feel like Cell um, fulfills the position of when it's a two-man team and he has a partner. I don't think he fulfills that role really well. I feel like he's just playing the point role all over again. Whereas if it's someone else who's in that role who shines it, like say for example, um, on my team, I have Team Gohan, and basically both of them are great um, in unit break, and both of them support each other. I feel like Cell's partners that support him but are last don't need him, and Cell doesn't really need his partners to excel when it's just him and someone else. Because you have to bear in mind, he's not going to have an assist that's going to be him either. It's just going to be Cell doing some assist that's going to help him. So yeah. let's say if, I, if and it's not going to be Kid Boo. So if it's not going to be Kid Boo, and it's not going to be Base Boo, there's no one in the current game unless you put Bardock Glass that's going to really help push Cell to be great as a mid. Just because of that, just because of 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 of, of, of the of the position of, of where you put Kid Boos and the Base Boos and all of that. So because, three point five for mid, or yeah, that, that, okay. Three do you, you wanna it. do you wanna round it off and do three point seven? Just because sub went four and you went three point five. No, I only hear I only hear why he put 
like four. But I because I, I, I understand why I wouldn't go in last season. But I'm like, Okay, yeah, cool. Because that's the only one you disagreed on uh, was the mid. So you said three point five sub. Uh, Rams Four, wants your defense. When you're mid, I, when you're mid, you're you're usually gonna have more meter than trying to play that early game point. And like, if you have the right uh, team to take advantage of like assist required mixups, he's gonna hit you. And level three knockdowns with Cell are. Almost season one, he just has to use meter and, or assist. The point, like point mm -hmm. cell, is kind of different. You you're not gonna you're gonna be starting off like bare bones. You gotta just use your assist to jail, like apply a lot of like universal mix up options. But he does have the TOD potential, and he does have like a lot of sequences, like two touch sequences, off like almost any touch, like five L or six M DR. So he could snowball really hard on point, but the pressure is not it's not as strong. Where is if you had if you had like ex perfect attack assist, you're gonna have to legitimately guess. So the offense kind of gets it's a little stronger when you're mid. Mm. But uh, actually, point two, he also builds resources for the mid, because he he's such a great battery too. Oh, okay, I get, yeah, I get what you, I get what you said about the mid now. Yes, because of the yeah. you, said, you said the ball. Yeah. Well, but he does struggle when, uh, like, let's say you, you do lose your point and you're playing like a, a two a two character shell, like Cell and Anchor. Uh, yeah. It's back to like either your Anchor is a mix up assist or it's a neutral assist, and then you have to like you know take your take your pick your poison. Are you gonna lack mix up if you're gonna spend the assist with with a two you know Cell character, or are you gonna lack neutral but have the mix up assist? And Cell's neutral is very risky trying to play it solo. Yeah, so, yeah, so I, I, yeah, that's back is in back the end what he said there, um, C4. So, about yeah, the race, like, like, yeah, like let's say you're playing like Cell Go Tanks, that's what I play, for example. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm gonna have to outplay them, or I'm gonna have to like come out on top somehow, uh, in the neutral if I want to capitalize with the donut assist. But donut can also function as a neutral assist, but uh. But if you have like SSJ or like a legitimate neutral assist like GT, you can play the neutral like any like any top tier character. But you're not gonna have legitimate pressure. But he has the options like you know, same side. Mm -hmm. He has like left right stuff, command grab in the corner. So he's kind of he's sort of flexible. Yeah, uh, it's pretty flexible. That's why I yeah. say four. That that kind of makes sense because like you're saying, it doesn't. Some characters lack something or can't do something due to their assist but you're saying cell can do two things he can go neutral heavy or an assist for the mix he's okay yeah, that, at both of them yeah it's like you, you're lacking one thing mm -hmm. but uh it depends mm -hmm. on what your anchor is like what's right. your yeah. anchor assist that's why really cell good. does really well with like if it's an assist that also helps you with mix-ups and neutral like base goku base goku has like a, some neutral presence and the block stands OD and you know you get um, the good mix-ups when he does with neutral uh Yamcha too go tanks too so that's like the that's like the two for one if you're gonna commit to like a neutral assist you might like mix-ups like, I agree, <laughs> I agree. Uh, yeah. I you you win, should we chuck a four <laughs> right, um I think three point seven five all right, three point seven. Three point seven. <laughs> he, doesn't wow. fuzzed, he doesn't get fuzzed anymore, though. Back in season two, oh, the reason why Fenrich, yeah, the reason why Fenrich, yeah. Fenrich tried to play Cell mid, he tried to play bottom point, but he yeah. realized he was giving Goichi a free 50 50 <laughs> every single time, right? Yeah, he's like, I don't even get to play Cell because if I get touched, he's gonna just snap loot me. Wait, see, like, let me just try. Wait. Let me just try point cell, so that way, if he if he that tries to go point. for a snap route, I don't have to guess. Yeah, no, yeah, you don't have to do that. Me. You don't have to do that anymore. No, but the difference here is just before we go into, but the difference here on this specific one is you've been in that situation where you've killed yeah. a, a Bardock and GT character in this season, and they have Bardock with GT, and you oh, have yeah, still yeah. with your That's neutral true. assist Gotex or base Goku. How the hell do you, you have to outplay them? You have to wait until GT goes, and then you got to guess and be like, okay, is he gonna IMD? Is he gonna run? You gotta, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta make the most of of your one opportunity. Yeah, <laughs> tell me the end, like it's just like that one shot. You're just waiting for that. 
that's the only reason I say 3.75 because it's so it's it's so based on outplaying. But I I I understand why you said four. I really get. You know what? Put it on four. Put it on four. <laughs> Yeah, I because I understand what um subset I, I get it. I, I'm more so I'm talking about like the whole aesthetic thing. He's doing the pure data of it. Like you when you have Soul and his partner, you're either going to try to control neutral or you can outplay them and when you touch them there's gonna be a mix. Right. Yeah. So, and it's only better than before because you're no longer getting fuzzy to having to put a mid. Yeah. So yeah, that's and that's a lot. Not not being in a Oh man, that was, that was a dark, dark, dark. <laughs> So yeah, we got we got four for point, four for mid, three for anchor. All of those are out five. Uh, yeah. Almost near the end now. Almost near the end. Next bit is uh, assist. Again, it's going to be split up into two points. Uh, it's a lot different now, I guess, with three assists. So th this might be a longer topic to talk about. Uh, no, nah, we both use the same assist. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, you both. Yeah, yeah. I was so excited for perfect attack assist, and then yeah. you know, I was disappointed. I was disappointed. You remember uh, in the house? Yeah. The yes. House. <laughs> I told you I was gonna play. I told you I was gonna play blue cool cell go tanks. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> look where we are. Yeah. Oh. They broke the rules, dude. Perfect attack's not supposed to be scaled. <laughs> Can't do that. Oh, yeah, Mace, what, what, what the rules for this? Uh, so I've got here for out of 10, lockdown and safety of an assist. Uh, the other half is versatility and extension capability. I, I don't know why I decided to use like massive words to make me sound smart. Lockdown smile. and safety, right? Yeah, lockdown no, safety? Four. No, four. Uh, out of 10. Four. With five, every assist, safety, out five. of 10. Safety of five? Oh, out of 10. Yeah, these are both uh, out of 10. These are both out of 10. So lockdown and safety. Including all three assists. I don't know if you've both like used. Yeah, we how, have. I, I, how much I, I, you tried to use it? Yeah. All three. Damn. You can't do all three, man. But that's that's you the game do. now. That's the game. You gotta do all three. No, but, oh. <laughs> because all, <laughs> what's what's good? the assist? <laughs> this is the freaking shoulder. It's it's is now it out. Combo? <laughs> it's now out. Was really fast. It's now that you say that before, I have to give him a three. <laughs> what is it, the I gotta, I gotta consider down. the shitty assists. <laughs> you got the worst assist if we're saying it in all okay. assists. I, I'm not gonna lie, I tried to I tried to up the score, but some makes a good point. Now I have to take in consideration the bad ones and he's actually brought the score down. So Can we can we just put multiple can we put considering three assists category into versatility? Please. Yes, please. Because it would be right. it would be really confusing trying to call three assists. Oh, I see. Yeah, no, they... no, no. That's totally that. To that makes way more sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So versatility would be the flexibility, basically, of assists that he can utilize. So one character could have like Krillin. He's got rock, beam, and soul. Yeah. Like he's got he's a ten in that category. So yeah, okay. Versatility yeah. would be the variety kind of. Uh, so yeah, all right. We'll do it that way. We'll do it that way. So you yeah, can. I think lockdown safety. We, we might just have to like pinpoint one assist. Yeah, which would be best. what? Beam is yeah. Beam his best one. Yeah, Beam is the greatest. Okay, we'll, we'll go with that then. We'll go with just Beam. And when I do the uh, other cards in the future, I'll say like the first lockdown of safety. Pick one assist. The next part out of ten will be overall assists. Okay, so lockdown and safety. Lockdown. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to know. I say 3.5. Out of what, 10? 10, right? Yeah. Oh, out of 10. Uh, lockdown, probably 6. 6. And then safety. safety. safety oh, like that's five. 1. Lockdown and safety is 1. It's, uh, oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. Those two out of 10. The next one will be... We'll talk about the uh, okay. overall of all the assists. So, yeah. Let me, let me say it again. Out of 10, we're going to mark lockdown and safety. That's all out of 10. Okay. I feel like safety... So what's the average, what's what's the the average of 6 and 9? Or the median? Yes. <laughs> 7.5. 7. 7. 7. 7. 7. Yeah. <laughs> because his safety is... is I've never safety. gotten happy birthday with my cell assist ever. Damn. <laughs> ever. Not once. Not once. 
No, even more. The, the, power no, the, power That's the power of angled assists. That's crazy, because now you said that, I don't think I've ever seen it either. I don't think I've ever seen someone get happy birthday with cell assist. Like, if they you put cell assist, yeah. You were holding forward. You know what would be funny? I think the only thing that could happy birthday is cell doing perfect attack. Yeah, and he like, <laughs> like... <laughs> no, but he ducks out the second you get hit. That's why cells are home. Like, yeah. this, this, this pops up. I'm actually having a better time trying to like counter poke when they when people try to call C assists. So that's kind of like a bad thing about C assists. They always it seems so telegraphed. Like has that whole flash. <laughs> they pop up right to you. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a reflect game for me because I I practice them all. all I mean the ones that are fast, but most of them have the same timing. So it's like. You just reflect it for a second, you see it, and it's over. Cool. Right. So that was the just for the beam assist out of 10. The next part, versatility. versatility. We'll get rid of the extension bit. We'll just get rid of the extension bit. Just versatility. So overall, do you think his uh, assists cover different options? Is there a reason to pick the other assists over beam, basically? Um, no. I think... Uh... <laughs> Like when you're playing Cell, you're not gonna, you're not playing him for his assists. You're you're usually gonna build around him mm -hmm. more so than trying to build another character with him. So, uh, Damn. self self kind of selfish. Yeah, you kind of you kind of pick him to take. You, you take the assists for what it is, the A assist. And you, yeah, we just make it work. Yeah, and it's, it's good enough. It's it's good it's, enough. Yeah, yeah. Its it main function is like defensive, kind of just. Yeah. Take your space, or you could do whatever you want, and then cover it with the assist. Uh, yeah. And then pressure's good, corner okay's good. Uh, so it's like Souls assist is like imagining, imagine SSJ Vegeta's assist was was made into a beam. Yeah, that's really that's good. what that, that's what Souls assist. Yeah. How we yeah. play Souls assist to be. <laughs> and we all and picking picking the character. It's like it's like it's like playing Bluku with his A. You you don't pick the A assist for another. You just deal with the assist. You're like, okay, wow. it's good enough. I'll I'll, I'll make it, yeah. I'll, I'll make, make it work. work. Yeah, yeah. I mean that means he he sounds like he's gonna score really low. Like if you go okay, A assist yeah, is a going five. Through. The other two assists bring it down to like a three. Yeah. So this is out of five. This is out of ten. Okay, so this is what like four, four point five, five. Four. He's a four. Four. Okay. Four. Like this is this is cells all his assist, right? This is cells beam assist, which which we have to make up combos on the fly. Okay. And train. Uh, he's a five four. hours a day. <laughs> <laughs> five hours a day to do this one specific route where you land on the ground and you hit with five M, which never ever works. Nah. My favorite combo extending back in season one with his assist was it was so hard. Impossible. Impossible. Right, so we're we're on the last part now. This one's a bit arbitrary, but I had to make up the numbers because the whole score is gonna be out of a hundred. So the last bit is damage without assists. Marks out five. So is the one damage. Damage without assist? Damage without assists. You can you can have limit break, you can have spark, but no assists. You can have all the bar you want as well. Like, everything you Eight. can, best That's... case scenario, with no assists. Oh, uh, is he an 8 or is he a 9? Oh, uh, I, I don't, I'm against 9, just this, because... This is out of 5, sorry guys, this is out of 5. I'm, I'm out of, okay. oh, out of 5? Well, yeah, out of 5. Remember, remember David, this probably exists, Luku exists. Ginyu exists. Um, Ginyu uses it... assists, though. True, oh. true, true, true. He more said solo. All right, so if we okay, let's just go. Okay, we, let, let's. So we got ca damaging characters. You have. You want to think like Tolhan, Basically. right? Tolhan will like touch anywhere oh, yeah. and murder you. No, it's just... yeah, no, no assist. Yeah, no assists. Tolhan does lots of damage when he's in mid screen. Sol can hit you mid screen and you still die. Zamasu can't hit you mid no, Zamasu without assists can't hit you mid screen and you die. Cell can. Um, Nappa can't hit you mid screen and you die. Yeah. 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 Kula can't do stuff like that mid screen and you die. Um, 
Twilling as great as he is, does some next pombo route. <laughs> That's true. So uh, Cell, Cell's yeah. not he's not doing the most. He's he's not out here in the corner. But mid screen, he kinda is. Mid screen he's or just he's... overall. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, yeah. so if, if you're saying that his mid-screen damage kind of makes up for his lack of corner damage, we, we can ban Oh, no, no, he's got, he's got a lot of corner damage, but it's not the the, the best. Like, some people just do, like, <laughs> ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. He's up there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Cell's, like, above average. Yeah. Everyone's, like, like some characters. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe they some characters just do so much damage. And then you get Trunks' level 3 afterwards, and it's like, oh, okay. And you've got like uh, the character specific stuff with Cell as well, where you can extend on like big bodies, right? With uh, with jump S. Yeah. Um, um... That's true. I would, okay. I, I maybe four four point five because I when I play like if you're max damaging with Cell solo, usually your situations are always like two touch. Kind yeah. of don't have. It's weird. You, yeah, you just end up. Yeah, now that you're saying, whenever I'm solo with Cell and I have. Cause... It's because you're always, you're also building the meter too. <laughs> yeah, he's right. He's right. He's like right. all your max damage confirms. He's able to just max damage almost any touch, like an air to air, super dash, dragon rush. <laughs> like and yeah, that, oh yeah, the buff. We forgot about one thing in the versatility in, in the in this air H perfect attack. That buff was like the greatest thing they ever gave Cell. So. Uh yeah, yeah, being able to uh, super dash cancel after vanish attack too. That helped a lot too. So like, because if you get EX perfect attack in the corner and you have to spend two bars to do like a shitty combo, now you could just do like super dash into loops. Ridiculous. And it's so much damage. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, damage by Souls up there because SSJ Goku is like dying somewhere, <laughs> but uh, he's alive. He still does his damage. So, who's a, who's a 10 or who's a 5? Who's a S 5? S Pro. S Pro. Yeah, you know. Yeah, not nice, as Brody. Like, you have to also, you have to have the corner damage, the mid screen damage, and the solo damage. But I don't think any character has all. I think Tohan is close. I think Tohan or S. Because Tohan will bomber you to the corner and then do his corner combo. No, right. Tohan, Tohan has to, Tohan's like really specific. It's like, okay, let's just say you were really optimized with Tohan and, or, and the world worked. Tohan's minimum doing. His least damaging is 3.7k by building a bar to spend the bar. His most yeah. damaging, with just random moves that hit you, is ranging from 6,000 to, in the corner, 8k. Um, mm. So yeah, Tohan is up there, but to get to that damage is is tricky. But yeah, he's up there. I, I told him, but to me, Blue Coon, Blue Coon's up there in, in, in that type of damage. Um, uh, just GT GT Goku's still there, damage people forget. Yeah, GT. Like, yeah. Um, yeah, maybe GT would be. Vegito, Vegito random kick. Vegito's random esports kick, but Vegito's not up there like, like that. He's not He's not um, shooting in the gym. Like that. I think he's close. Actually, you know, I think he might be closer to Tohan, to be fair. Like, Vegito. I think, like, yeah, Vegito Tingohan's around five category. Blue Ku Cell GT's like four. Mm, okay. So, where, so where's Basku? considering solo with no assists. Oh, Basku. Oh, okay. Yeah, where would Basku go there? Basku would be up. Basku does... I, I showed him my stream the other day. By himself, if you just get a command grab, it's 36%. <laughs> with a limit break. Just 36%. But if you get hit, you lose 56% from every other option. BR with no meter, 56%. 2M with no meter, 56%. So... Um, and then you guess for game. So um, base is really strong. Oh, yeah, base cook. Yeah, I forgot about um, base cook and Broly. How do we do that? Do we Broly, do that? Really, even Kula. Kula just lands a little. No, well, Kula's different. He lands an EX movement, does one yeah. million percent. Or even um, like uh, base Gita. Like base Gita in the corner is crazy now. But in season two, when he could get the loops mid screen, he was cr mm. he would have been like a five. But they they knew his mid screen stuff, so he would probably be like a four. But I still think. From what both of you are saying, I think Cell is more consistent than base GR because base GR really doesn't get much mid screen. It's all corner, all of it's corner. Yeah, right? yeah. Because Cell builds yeah. the bar, he builds the bar, then does four. What, what is it? Um, David, is it like four K or something? Just from an LL, blah blah blah, um, super dash. 
to me yeah, it's at least it's at least like 1.7 meter and then doing 3.8 yeah. 4k yeah 3.8 4k and then he, he can he, it's easy for him to to chase your text or whatever he does so yeah mm, yeah he's up there it's just hard though right? when i look at the classes i'm looking at them not even jiren does damage man <laughs> jiren yeah does. yeah jiren does do damage i, I guess they have the reps. It, it helps when you have like a JS that ground bounce and hits twice. <laughs> that should help. Like with Team Gohan, his bombs, so his yeah. JS, June's JS. Yeah. All right. You, you know what? Sol's not at the top top, but he's he he's, sounds he's, super consistent. He's, oh, yeah. he's, he's that's what make that's what his strength. Yeah. He's Sol's <laughs> weakness. I all I can think of is that yeah, when so if so has no assist. It doesn't matter what the first hit was. The second hit is going to kill you. It, it doesn't seem to matter. It could be IAD light light. And it's like, well, I'm dead now. Because he, he touched me before this. And I... Yeah. He not does six points. Like yeah. 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 Like, um, Sub was saying it. The two touch. It's like, he touches you once for 3.8. And you get yeah. DR. That's fine. That's your dead. Um, yeah. You get... Um, so, you get, if you get DR straight away, you're not dead. You're guest for game. But if you get hit by anything else, <laughs> then you're dead. So yeah. Um, so yeah, I think so, yeah. Damage, he he's up there, but he's just he's not the, the best best. But he's up there. So we're we thinking low, like a little bit lower than a four. Nah, he's definitely. Uh, I think he's so, so, four. He's a four at the beginning. Like, I think four? that I'm trying to refute it. It's really hard to kind of go against it, man. This. We'll so put him in between four and four point five. Yeah. Between that, yeah? Um, yeah. Damn, I'm giving these, these hard numbers. Five point... Well, yeah. Let's go. But five point two like, or five point three? It's hard to value... It's hard to value raw damage in a certain situation rather than, like, high damage mm -hmm. consistently overall, like, in most situations. Like, in all the situations. Yeah, so it's it's even, even, right? Like, what do you value? What's, 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 what's more significant? High damage or consistent damage, right? Yeah. Burst damage or consistent. See, it's hard for me because my team is built with both of them. Um, From what you two have said about Cell, I would feel like consistency is why you play Cell. Personally. Mm -hmm. Cell's got loads of options. And for me, when he's last, I, I don't know about some, but it's... If, it, if it's Cell alone, when I hate perfect attack someone and I vanish, you know you've lost 5,000. When I... Hit you with an M, you know you've lost six thousand. When I DR you, you're at least losing and fifty percent. When I IAD you, you know you're losing forty percent. If I do my combos right mid screen, you know you're losing forty percent. Like it's just these little things. Obviously, there's characters that have higher values in these areas, but cell is really simple. I hit you and I hit you again. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know, so I don't know. That's the only reason why I thought of like four point two five. What, what about you, Sub? Like, is that the same? Is that that's the same for you, right? I'm, I'm yeah. pretty... I don't I don't know Max damage routes for every single character, but because I play Cell, so, yeah, it's it's really easy and it's very consistent. The other characters, you guess. Like, like I, I only have that with Hit, where I know what's gonna kill. Like Cell, so you just know. You're like, okay, I did an IAD. The next time I IAD and I have an assist, it's over. <laughs> or like last season. You start with a round start, super dash and assist, and then you combo. Or if I was playing um, subs team, if I make them block Gotenks once and I hit him with a high, sub knows if he DRs with an assist that that level three, you're either not dead and you're on death's door, or like you're gonna guess or you're dead or stuff like that. So yeah. you can so allows you to be consistent in the number bridging, you know? Yeah, 4.25. 4 point... You, you guys, all right. 4.25. Will you even let me do yeah. this? Yeah, because it's the burst. The burst damage is, is, is season I mean, three. I could, we, could, I, we could go on all day, dude. If you, like, just, like, <laughs> yeah. separate every single category. Like, yeah, you know what? You really it is kind of my fault. I, I shouldn't have allowed the decimal points in the first place. It's my fault. I'm going to have to... Uh, I'm going to have to deal with what I've created. That's cool, though. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool. It's your fault for saying when you guys mentioned burst damage and... Consistent damage. Mm. So, yeah. The lockdown and safety one, 
might have to you might have to bifurcate that 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 attribute or something maybe yeah i'm gonna i'm definitely gonna look at it if i if i do and i change it up too much i'll obviously uh get yours your guys uh opinion on it again and redo it uh at the moment though before i tell you because i don't think you can see what what do you think his score is like so so all of this uh accumulates to 100 what do you think he scored out of 100 it's, he's he's b minus b or b b b plus b plus what's that in numbers i need numbers no algebra oh 80s numbers. high 80s high 80s 68 see i say yeah. 68 to 76. He has, everything. he has everything but he sucks in one thing he does everything really well sucks in one thing it's like sssb <laughs> that's so cool all right so it's it adds up to 71.05 71 71. <laughs> 71 out of 100 i guess if i mean that's good. If, i mean technically no one's gonna be 100 yeah, no, definitely no one's gonna be. Oh, actually, that reminds me. There's a, there's a poll I'm gonna throw up in the in the Twitch, so people can vote and they can, uh, you know, give the the people's opinion on the score. But yeah, I guess what the highest we're probably gonna get is like a ninety. May maybe someone will scratch a ninety. And if you only, Bard that way, only Bardock can touch such numbers. Bardock, you think Bardock touches ninety? Maybe he might. Yeah, he might. He might, yeah, he might. We'd even mention him for like consistent damage too. He has very consistent damage. It's just too much, man. It's just too much. I didn't think Bud would be that. Uh, maybe we'll see. I, I always think Kid Boo would be the one to scrape the scratch the ninety mark. Maybe. Uh, Kid Boo. Actually, good choice. Good. Assists are both good. His assists are both good. His yeah. damage is really good. Um, string is not okay. Frame bit is, mm, yeah, frame, frame bit is, uh, <laughs> becomes what you want it to be. <laughs> yeah. Becomes what Magic you want frame. it to be. I, I think 70, I mean, it's a low, it's a very low 70, but I think that's really solid. Uh, yeah, characters are definitely going to be lower than 70. Yeah, that's yeah. Like some, char like, some characters, a good amount might be very low just because they're so situational and they don't have like the stuff you listed. Yeah, and 70 for me, like someone said, because it's for me 70, 70, 80s, I said 68, 76. That is B. That's like B plus. That is, <laughs> when, you get, when you get like the report card back from the school, that is a B right there. That is B in that. <laughs> that and I feel, as I saw like, so I don't like, I don't know rankings or whatever. If I ever saw Cell on the podium, he's, he's not at the top shining of everyone. He's just that conductor in the back. You know, he's smart, but. He's not there. Like he's not. He's not. He's not. He's not like a, a gifted, gifted and talented, you know. And he's not. He's not. He's not a prodigy. He's just below. He works hard for either. He works smart. Other characters work hard. He works smart. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I think that's about it. I think that's a. Uh, that went better than I thought it would. Uh, I'm definitely gonna adjust stuff. I don't know who I'm gonna get in next. I kind of want to get someone. On the lower end, might try and look for some some jeering heads. So you're gonna do this for each character? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and do this for each character. Get two people, uh, discuss right. it, and then yeah, at the end have like. Good idea. I think it's slightly better than doing the tier list. Uh, not much because it's it's still gonna be opinion based. But I feel at least this way I can back it up. If someone says, "Oh, why did you just put cell there?" Yeah, I agree. Yeah, a lot of tier lists just being uh thrown out nonchalant and a lot of people actually disagree on it like set itself solving like the few of, of three of us that are left actually yeah. primarily and like we we play very differently but we all come to the same conclusion of, of how like Solzicist works um his placement yeah. his partners like we, we like it, how we stagger pressure it all imagine for all different regions but it's the same conclusion because that's just the way cell is you know Mm -hmm. um, yeah. but, but other characters are like that. Like some kid blue players think he's amazing. Some think he's terrible. I don't. I don't know. Really. So. It'll, it'll be tough. I'll, I'll try and get like reasonable people. You used to be pretty reasonable. You didn't like downplay or upplay. I think if anything, you upplayed. I thought he was going to score lower. I think. Oh really? To, yeah, I thought he was going to get like a sixty odd. Uh, I didn't think 
the normals threw me off. I like, I know his normals are strong, but you used to like made me you gave me PTSD for when I used to play as much and I I got obliterated just because I, I tried we to might have, we, might have, we might have overplayed his the beginning. <laughs> I mean, you, you but, talked it up. I believe it. For me, for me, it's like neutrals is like everything. Like decision making and neutrals was gonna, you know, get you your return. So, I mean, so yeah, yeah. like that, like um, like some what other like player, like like now this is different, but so has to actually think about how many jumps the person has used so that you can yeah. get in and string yeah. them. Are they are they blocking standing when I'm doing my my pressure? Are they blocking crouching? Did they get? Are they holding? When I press S, what did they do after? Are they holding? Like, come on, man! So, so I was thinking about all of that, but he allows you to do this because his strings are so long. They're all so many lows, all true. Like, so many. Little... He's got like a million charge moves in him as well, so he can literally do. If if you play like a first to ten set with someone, it feels like every string is different in the first to ten. Yeah, like, because you just, you're figuring stuff out, man. Like. Like sometimes, it, like I know some this as well. You do six H and you press S. If you just press S S and they get hit, I know you're matching. Like I'm like you are matching, or you get you do M and another M. I'm like you got hit. You are either matching reflect or you're you're trying to take. You're trying to um, force a turn. Not even take it. You're trying to force a turn. You know. That? Even so, the big thing is like if. Which, if the opponent had like, he 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 can't he gets zoned. That's the thing. He 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 could get yeah. zoned. He doesn't have any answer to to. He doesn't have any like thing to incentivize the opponent to try to approach him because he can't keep them. He he can't uh like go in. He can't instill his will. And uh, also, what was it? Um. Like yeah, he just he has to he has to hit you. Nope, he doesn't have like a key blast, so. See, so He's I, like, I, I imagine purposely. Bardock. Sorry, go on, go on. Yeah. I, I was gonna say. No, I was imagine Bardock without. So, sounds like Bardock's same plan, but imagine not having Lariat to actually scare them to stop doing their zone. Yeah. <laughs> they, they just keep zoning Cell, and then you just gotta find a cheeky way to get in. Yeah. Like if the oh yeah, I was gonna say if like the opponent had like a good read on your movement, for example, and they kept you out. It's really hard as sell to try to come at like eventually find control afterwards, because he doesn't have anything to do when he's out. <laughs> Whereas a character has a key blast, they're totally fine like trying to find that that control in the pace using key blast or you know that that way they could make their approach more ambiguous. Cell is just like I, I gotta I gotta finesse my movement even more or you know I gotta I gotta double down on going in and try to outplay them from there. See, Mace? So that's, that's, like, that's, yeah, that's I, like the I fault, totally and it, it's very big. I, I totally agree. The only reason I didn't put that as a, uh, as a topic was because you can... It's going to sound like super cringe, but you can just call an assistant super dash. That's why I didn't want to put too much of a talking point on a character's approach, because every character can approach the same way depending on their assist. But I do agree with you. The way... If you're not, if you don't play a beam assist and you've got to work your way in, Cell has to finesse you. Where other characters, they their super dash is part of their randomness to get in, like to keep you guessing. Cell can't just like he doesn't really yeah. randomly super dash. Have, like everyone has that approach, right? Super dash assist. Cell doesn't have anything to rotate from if if the opponent is always looking for it. Whereas key blast characters, they can rotate between going in, keeping you out. And then controlling that pace, resetting their assist. Yeah. Resetting their assist, going back, jumping up. So I was like, yeah, once you break up from someone doing 5S, and you're like, okay, I've got space now. What do you do? Are you going to throw that Kamehameha, which your opponent's waiting for? Are you going to jump in the air and allow them to catch you? Yeah, like, there's these little things. You have to be And on really top of that, like, when he gets zoned, he can't deal with zoning. <laughs> oh, yeah. I see you. When you're getting zoned, you're just, you're just going to be... What, what are you doing full screen? You know? But it doesn't chip, so it's like... Eh. You're fine. Yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll definitely revisit this. Uh, um, maybe. I mean, this is going to take a while, so there might even be a patch before. I mean, if you if you added in, if you did add in like the neutral aspect, he wouldn't have been seventy then, probably C four. No, I agree. Neutral would have he would have scored not so great actually. Do Do you think it's worth adding neutral? 
Um... Like, so when I oh. think of the top tier characters, I don't think they've got good neutral. <laughs> that, but that might just be me. I think there's characters that bypass neutral, but I don't think it's good neutral. So, 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 like, let's just go, if you just do the typical characters people would normally throw at the top, top of the hat, um, if you say, like, the Kid Boost, right? You mm -hmm. say Kid Boost, you say Tohan, mm -hmm. um, you say Base right. Cheetah, Bardock, right? Yeah. Um, they have, just go fighting game, fight, just fighting game in general, let's go with Bardock, for instance. Bardock and Cell are pretty similar. But, but but Bardock actually has an S, so he has something that makes you, as the opponent says, hmm, he could throw this S, so this may elicit an action from me, or he has a Lariat, so the closer he gets to me, this isn't this 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 option is available. Yes, Super Dash is there, but he has this other tool which which has an impact on your options as the defender or the opponent, whereas. Kate Booth, for instance, his, just his S alone, his 1M, his 3M. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, true, those, yeah. Things, those things make you, they they, they, they are, okay, as a, as you're the opponent, already psychologically, you're thinking, okay, yes, there's Super Dash, which is natural for all of us, we can all walk, Super Dash is as much as walking, but they have something else that makes me, who doesn't have this tool, have to think about something. So as a Cell player, the only thing I have to stop that Kid Boo or Bardock doing whatever they're doing full screen, is to throw out a 26 plus frame full screen beam that, that, that um, naturally when someone is moving, can, that, that it, it, it's, it's an unsafe, it's very committal. It's a very committal option. All right. So let's, it's, it's let's, my neutral. Let's that's do also this. full screen. He's, that's all he has. Let's Whereas do this right now, right? Screen. Let's do this right now. Out of, if we, I'm going to add neutral in there, but should it be out of five or should it be out of 10? How important do you think neutral is for a character to be like top tier? I would, I would say more than half. <laughs> in in this season, you, you, unless you unless you have I mean, burst damage. I mean, Goichi showed us. Pardon? Goichi showed us neutral is king. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Neutral, neutral, neutral is king. Even right now, he's playing two Bs because he's like, you know what? I can't. Yeah, I'm doing burn damage. I'm not worried. Yeah, I'm not worried about the the pressure. Like as long as I always have that up, or as long as I always have that opportunity to approach you from neutral, I can, I can come out on top. Yeah. So I think neutral is yeah, especially in this season, it's necessary. There's no snap. Um, games, games, yes, games are fast or whatever, but even when someone's in lead break, if you just, if you're just having great neutral, you're, you're creating situations where your opponent has to do something, you know, so. All right, I'm, I'm adding neutral now. Out of 10, what we give himself, oh. and I'll, I'll, I'll add this to all the other characters when I do them as well. Solo or with, with assists? I think it's the same for the most part with assists. Yeah, same with assist because either yeah. way, uh, assist kind of just goes into like, like, like offensive or like priority, I guess. Because mm. like, like if you put the best assists with like Vegito, put the best assists with like Krillin. Yeah, so like, yeah, Shudan makes a point. He says if it's ten, but I think this is what he's trying to say. If it's ten, that's including assist. If it's without including assist, it should be something like a five out of five. Because okay. the assist makes such a big difference to a character's neutral. Okay. So neutral with resources, neutral solo. Yeah. Neutral solo? Uh, out of five, oh. two? 2.5? 3? <laughs> no, 3. 3. 3? <laughs> oh, because of 2S. Yeah, you can't 2S without assists. Yeah, yeah, I guess. Yeah, I guess you can't. I guess you can't. I want to say. I want to say. I've I've seen cells do it, but it's not a good idea. Wait, wait, wait! wait. So cells are free. Cells bang in the middle. Yeah, yes. neutral solo. This is without assists. Yeah. Yeah. Rams, you on board? Cells free without assists. Out of five. Yeah. Out of five. Do you want to go lower or do you try to go higher? 
me look at the cast real quick. Let me look at the cast real quick. Piccolo. Piccolo. Oh my god, Piccolo. <laughs> Zamasu. Okay, wait, wait, wait. So I'm guessing. I, in my head, this is what it was. I don't know if this is in some okay, This is solo on solo. So this is Cell versus a solo character, right? It's not Cell versus... Yeah, I, I yeah. understand. Yeah, one on I, one. No one has been sat full screen grand finals and getting zoned by S with Cell and picking. Where am I going to sweep it? I should die for it. You don't know how that feels? <laughs> um, jokes aside, um, I'm looking at the cast now. Okay, I, I, I like a free because I looked at Piccolo and I just laughed. And I looked at Adam Gohan, even though he's a true warrior race. Like Don't underestimate us! Damn. Uh, sorry, I, I got 10 gift subs. I wasn't expecting that. That's mad. Shouts to Lynx. Lynx OB. Uh, safe for that. Uh, so, yeah, back to. Obviously, because I'm uploading this to YouTube. Uh, I'm going to have to true change up race. Don't the chart slightly. Do, so, do you want to add neutral with assists? Or is that. Is that too much? Because you could say, well, this character with GT is always going to have good news. The Saiyans are a true warrior race. Don't underestimate us. We could take it away. I don't really... No, we could we could scale it like equally. Like if we're comparing both with with the GT assist, I think that way you'll get like you'll get more like of the top tiers being around the 70s, and then you could start. The seeing, Saiyans like, are a true warrior for, race. For, 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 Don't for, underestimate like, us. So, do you think we should say, okay, we've got the neutral solo, and then we've got neutral with two beam assists, just straight up. You've got GT and SSJ Goku assists. This doesn't make sense. The I'm sorry. Are a true warrior race. Don't <laughs> like, make us. sense anymore. Like, like, but did, you, just giving anyone with two assists, you, of course you can get in. This is who you are. You just walk forward. If I'm doing. ET and a beam, of course, anyone in the game can walk forward unless your forward button is broken. The Saiyans are so a true warrior race. Solo, right? Don't underestimate us! Is that but what you're saying, man? Yeah. Just leave it solo, sub, yeah? Yeah, just yeah. solo. Man. Actually, yeah, solo, yeah, yeah. Great scenario. I, I mean, like, like he just did for us, like, That's true, yeah. by, by himself. Because, versus... yeah, it, the most frequent times, the Saiyans like, are a true you are going to be having to play Don't neutral solo. Don't underestimate us! Trying to play neutral solo. Especially now, I may, do, why I don't like saying um, stuff like, oh, assists uh, take away neutral. That's not true in this season. In this season, your assists take a long time to come back. They the are so are many true warrior people. race. Don't underestimate us. You pull their assist, they pull their assist. What are you doing for the rest of those five seconds? You are just flailing about, jumping around, flapping yeah. in the air. Like okay. Yeah. Yeah. Like neutral is... The Saiyans are a true neutral. warrior race. Don't neutral underestimate us. In, in this season means a lot more than it's ever had before. Now you don't just liberally throw assists. Now if I throw TNS is full screen, let's say um, you, you broke Shuridan. Look at his team. He does two beams. Where the hell the rest of the assists come? He's got to pretend to play neutral. The Saiyans are a true team. warrior race. <laughs> Don't underestimate us. The thing about his team, all his characters, is they all have beams. They yeah. all, they and, all um, and he's got a C assist. He's got Kula C assist. Yeah, Kula C assist, TN A assist, and Blue G at one point. It is, it smokes and mirrors. He, if you block both his beams and then he hits you, he's finessed you so well. Like the... exactly. So, so, so that's why I feel like yeah, the assist thing. Yeah, all memes aside, it doesn't really like the solo thing actually makes sense because in this game there are so many situations where you have. Forget about a solo. You're gonna have no assist. Your sister recovering. How are you getting in? How is Cell like? Even though I play Cell versus T Gohan, how is Cell getting in against T Gohan? How are you uh -huh. honestly getting in against T Gohan properly? A smart one, not just some one who just spams on you. How are you getting in? You know, you're, you're praying. How are you getting in against a, a Bardock who actually just throwing one S and can two hate for it off? Yeah. Uh, that's rough all right what, what i'll do is i'll uh i'll add neutral to the list i'll make it out of 10 so i'll double the three that you gave him because that was out of five so we'll give him a six out of ten right for solo neutral yeah, yeah. playing the neutral solo uh i think because he's better than average is having no s and above average is having an answer to s <laughs> uh having so... to s ultra instinct goku <sighs> oh 
I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna have to do, have to look at that character. Even well. it, I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> so, um, uh, but yeah, you know I I might call upon you again, sub for for when we get to go tanks. Oh, okay. <laughs> that that might be a thing. And Rams, uh, I might have to get you off a hit at some point. So uh, I'm, I'm here. No, it's more than this. But yeah, I don't know who I'm going to get ne- uh, get on for next week. I'm going to try and do it every Friday. Uh, thanks everyone who jumped in. Hopefully, it was interesting, a bit of fun, whatever. I am going to make the. I'm doing this all in the Google uh, Doc, so people can look at it and whatnot. Uh, oh, let me see what the people in the chat actually said because I did a poll. What did they say? Your results. Seventy-five. That's what the majority of people voted for 75 out of 100 so they're basically what we what used to you guys said so damn the stream monsters are actually pretty smart this is a uh, this is nice this is nice <laughs> all right cool right i'm gonna let these guys off it's, it's pretty okay. late over here it's 11 o'clock uh sub's got his whole day to enjoy uh, i'll let both these players do their little plugs i'll go find someone to host uh, and again i want to thank uh sub and rmz for jumping on they didn't have to uh, it's super appreciated but uh, yeah sub if you want to plug your stuff uh, shouts to uh, what's your sponsor's name something democracy brutal democracy right yeah, yeah. brutal yeah. democracy anything subatomic savers you'll find me twitter twitch and youtube thanks for having me c4 I think this is a great idea by the way thanks a lot man thanks for having me Mason. always everyone knows if you don't know my twitch by now then unlucky <laughs> did you just don't say if you don't know I'm lucky <laughs> It's a sign, RMZ0. I don't really plug much, but RMZ0 on Twitch and RMZ underscore UK. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, uh, if you like this for, uh, format, if you like this kind of uh, podcast discussion thing, let people know. Uh, I think it'll be a lot more interesting with more people interacting in the chat and stuff. But uh, yeah, I'll I'll be on a hunt for more top players to uh, talk about some characters. Uh, who is streaming? Lord Knight's on. There we go. Lord Knight will do. Uh, but yeah, take it easy, guys. Peace. Take care, man.